dear students now we are going to discuss rl series circuit in detail it is an electric circuit which consists of the resistor in series with the inductor simply we can say a resistor and inductor both are connected in series here r represents the resistance with the unit ohm l represents the inductance value with unit henry so here this resistor and inductor both are connected in series the current is same but the voltage is divided the voltage drop across this resistance is vr the voltage drop across this inductor is vl okay so here the total voltage is equal to the sum of the voltage drop across the resistor and the voltage drop across the inductor so here there is one more term that is what impedance so here the impedance of the series circuit is nothing but z that is equal to the resistance plus jxl so what is xl that is the inductive reactance of this inductor so here impedance of the circuit is r plus jxl r is the real path which denotes the resistance value xl is an imaginary value that is the inductive reactance of this inductor do you all understand this one so impedance is also very important in this one so here i is the current flowing in this rl circuit so here current is same but the voltage is divided between the elements vr is the voltage drop across the resistance so according to ohm's law we can get the value as i into r so next the voltage drop across the inductor is vl that is equal to i into xl so here xl is nothing but the inductive reactance its value is 2 pi f into l so what is 2 pi f angular frequency omega so we can say the inductive reactance value as omega l okay so this inductive reactance is an imaginary value okay so next we are going to discuss the uses of this rl series circuit where we are using the circuit exactly so this rl series is widely used in rf amplifiers as dc power supply because the inductor allows only the dc current and it blocks the rf back to the supply so it can be used as a supply in the rf amplifier so we can say that as dc power supply because it allows only dc current do you all understand this one so it is very important rl series circuit can be used as a dc power supply in rf amplifiers and also in real time applications we can say this rl series circuit can be used as choke of the luminance tube that is tube light okay and it can also be used in electric machine windings etc do you all understand this one next we are going to discuss the phasor diagram of rl series circuit this phasor diagram concept is very important in electric circuits because it is a convenient way of representing the vector quantity in electrical circuits because it has both magnitude and phase so first we are going to find out the phasor diagram for this a resistor only circuit then the inductor only circuit finally we can combine these two phasor diagrams to get the rl series circuit okay so first we are going to consider the resistor only circuit in this the current is flowing through this resistor then the voltage drop across this resistor is vr so here the relation between current and voltage is directly proportional that means if the voltage is increased current is also increased so what is the behavior of resistor it is simply going to oppose the flow of current correct so here we can say the voltage is directly proportional to the current if voltage increases current is also getting increased so here we can say the voltage and current both are 
in phase quantity that means here the voltage starts at this point 0 the current is also getting started from that point 0 that phase is same okay so next we can consider the inductor only circuit in this the current is flowing through this inductor so what is the behavior of inductor so when the current is flowing through this it creates magnetic flux around it so here the inductor is going to oppose or change the phase of the current so here we can say if the voltage starts at this point zero then the current is lagging behind this voltage by 90 degree so here we can say this is the phase value okay so here the current lags behind this voltage by 90 degree that means when the voltage is maximum the current is minimum do you all understand this one so here we can represent the phasor diagram like this that is the current is lagging by 90 degree with respect to this VL do you all understand this one so here we can find out the phasor diagram of RL circuit by combining the resistor only and inductor only circuits. Okay. So here the current is flowing through this resistor. So here the voltage drop across this resistor is directly proportional to the current that is given here. But the current due to this inductor is lagging by 90 degree with respect to VL. So here we can get this VL diagram like this. Okay, then the resultant RL series circuit can be drawn like this with the length V is equal to square root of VR squared plus VL squared with the phase 5. So this phase is nothing but the phase angle of this RL series circuit that can be obtained by taking the turn inverse of the imaginary value of the impedance to the real value of the impedance. Do you all understand this concept? Next, we are going to discuss the characteristics of RL series circuit. So, here the important parameter is impedance of the circuit. Impedance represents the total resistivity of the circuit. So, here it has the resistance value as well as the reactance value. So, Z is equal to R plus JXL. It is in a rectangular form. Okay, real and imaginary. It can also be mentioned in terms of polar form that is what the magnitude with the phase so in electric circuits we can use the term magnitude along with its phase so here we can use this polar form the same impedance can be written as modulus of z with a phase angle phi so here modulus of z is nothing but that magnitude that is equal to square root of r square plus xl square and here the phase value is equal to turn inverse of the imaginary to the real part. So imaginary is XL, real is R. Okay. So these two values are important to draw the phasor diagram. Okay. The so next one is apparent power. That is the general term of power S is equal to V into I. As we all know that the power is nothing but the multiplication of voltage and current. So in this we are having the real term and imaginary term. So here we can have the real power due to the resistive element alone. So that is represented as P that is equal to V into I cos phi. The next one is reactive power due to the reactive element XL. So it can be represented as Q that is equal to V into I sin phi. Okay. And the next one is power factor. This is very very important parameter to get the performance of the RL series circuit. So that is cos phi with a lag condition. So here phi is the phase angle. So in this RL series circuit current lags behind the voltage by 90 degree. So here we can say the power factor is also a lag. Okay. So this is very important characteristics of this RL series. Here the current lags behind the voltage by 90 degree that means here we can consider the current is getting voltage signal starts at zero here we can say this is the voltage signal starts with the phase zero so here we can say the current is starting at this point that is 
lagging behind the voltage. So here 90 degree lagging with respect to this voltage. Do you all understand this concept? So we can say the current is lagging behind this voltage by 90 degree. Okay, so this can be proved with this expression. In general, we can say the voltage is equal to according to Ohm's law I into R. So here R can be written as the impedance value. So V is equal to I into Z. From this we can get I is equal to V by Z. So I is equal to V by Z. V is the angle with the phase 0 degree. But here the impedance is nothing but the magnitude with the phase 5. Okay. So we know that the magnitude of this V by Z is nothing but the magnitude of the current. Correct. But here we are having the phase angles. So it is in division. So in terms of division we are going to subtract the phase angle. So 0 degree minus 5 degree. So this can be written like this minus 5. So this can be written as minus 5. Do you all understand this one? So current is nothing but with the magnitude i with the phase minus 5. Okay, so this is nothing but the phase difference. It is lagging. Minus means lagging. Okay.